Hello, everyone. What the fuck? Yeah, hello. Yeah, I'm young and queer. I feel let's go for your wet dream. <laughs> Can I just say as well, it's good that Freddie's come dressed as the way a child would draw a tree. I like that. That's good. Thank you. It's, it's good that you've come dressed as a man that's trying to plead in court whether or not he can see his kid. <laughs> Um, Hi, <laughs> uh, okay. Sam, so this is uh, this, this, this looks like the gay kid and the Christian evangelical <laughs> trying to get <laughs> bought something. Break the gay away! Hi. Have you thought about conversion therapy? <laughs> I want another I want another career after conversion therapy, mate. <laughs> <laughs> okay, sound. Uh, which how, how should we decide who goes first here? Uh, do you want to do rock paper scissors? One, two, three, go like that. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> sound. That one. Sound. That one. That one you went too early. That's yeah. your fault, Tony. Can say go. Okay. <laughs> right. I don't know if you uh, lovely people here know this, but Sam used to work in Primark, which explains why his comedy sets are made up of such cheap, shoddy material. Uh, <laughs> And his jokes were written by Filipino Charm Play. <laughs> he does. He does a lot of odd gigs. So I'm gonna the only ones he can get. And when Sam was asked recently to do a charity gig for the rehabilitation of sex offenders, he was touched. <laughs> <laughs> And he enjoyed it by the looks of it. <laughs> Most action I've ever got. <laughs> Is that done? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, you might be able to tell this as by uh, everything about Tony, uh, but Tony recently went through a divorce. <laughs> 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 Uh, the words is that I'm not gonna like stand up here and just say that uh, t like Tony's much happier now that him and his wife are divorced because uh, that would be a lie. He's dead depressed about it. It really, <laughs> it really upset him. Uh, but no, him and his wife didn't have a lot in common. Uh, like the only thing they really had in common is uh, Tony is left-handed and she's left with half of his stuff. <laughs> That's all I've got for that one. <laughs> uh, actually, my ex-wife now, she's divorced twice, once from me and <laughs> once from reality. So, uh, <laughs> there we go. Uh, Sam, not surprisingly, he was uh, bullied at school. I mean, who saw that fucking coming? Uh, which is why he quit teaching. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Like every other fucking stand-up, uh, Sam has ADHD, which when you're a comedian means attention, desperate humour dickhead. <laughs> Claiming you have ADHD when you're a performer is like saying you're a fashion model with an eating disorder or a PE teacher who's on the sex offenders <laughs> register. <laughs> it's basically taken as a given. Uh. <laughs> Uh, so, um, Tony's next wife. Yeah, it's it's a lot of divorce jokes. <laughs> There's fuck all interesting about the cunt. I'm going to... Like, fucking... Look, I'm a fucking minefield for roasts. And he was like, I've got, I had a tortoise when I was six. <laughs> Where were that dickens? Uh, um, no, he... Uh, so, his, his ex-wife... Let me get this up. His ex-wife was... Um, yeah, the divorce was, it was tricky, but it was right in the long run, you know, because uh, Tony is now, uh, for the first time in a very long time, is happily in a relationship, and uh, his wife, the first time in a very long time, is feeling what an orgasm feels like when I shag her every night. <laughs> um, <laughs> Sam. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> 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 um, Tony's, Tony's uh, dad actually got divorced as well, and then Tony has also got divorced, so I think this trend will uh, carry on, and if Tony has kids, they'll also be divorced from reality and think they're funny enough to be comedians. <laughs> that was shit. <laughs> is that? Yeah, that's it. Uh, right, Sam is uh, bulimic. Uh, sorry for bringing that up, uh, Sam. <laughs> You must be sick of people mentioning it. Uh, and as a child, uh, Sam suffered from meningitis, and uh, being a bisexual adult, he now suffers from men in Titus. 
Uh, Tony has a Tony has a, a phobia. Uh, it's a, quite a, quite a strange phobia. Toby is scared of buttons, like the ones on clothes. It's a proper phobia. It's got what, what's it called? Uh, How do you pronounce it? Compoundophobia, I believe. Oh, cool. I thought it was pronounced "stop being a little bitch." <laughs> <laughs> Are you, are you genuinely afraid of buttons, Tony? Yeah. I am, yes. Yeah. I, I have some horrific news about oh, your yeah. sleep. <laughs> <laughs> but bizarrely, only when they come off of clothes. Oh, that's really? What's sad is he's never been to a panto. <laughs> <laughs> <That's true. laughs> he's behind him, fuck! <laughs> it actually, uh, his fear of buttons actually stemmed because uh, he was sexually assaulted by Caroline's evil mum. That was a too niche a reference. <laughs> Go on, that's all I've got. Is that all? Uh, right. Uh, Sam's favourite band is uh, the 1975, which ironically is when his mum bought most of his clothes. <laughs> Sam is currently seeking an autism diagnosis, uh, mostly to give his comedy career a boost, uh, <laughs> give him a subject for an edible festival show, and get a Radio 4 series. <laughs> Uh, that, yeah, uh, Tony, Tony's been doing uh, comedy for quite a while. Uh, he once had an Edinburgh show uh, which five days in a row had zero audience members. Uh, yeah, which, uh, to be fair, standing alone in a room, very much good preparation for the Christmas after she left. <laughs> When, uh, when his when his ex wife actually filed for the divorce, uh, it was just a clip of a stand up, and the judge went, "Yeah, I'd fucking want to divorce that as well." To be honest with you, um, but uh, and Tony, Tony was uh, really nice to me when I started. Tony was at my fifth ever gig, and he, do you remember this? You messaged me, and it was like, "If you want to, um, like, drop my name in to get gigs, you can tell from us." Oh, Tony Cowards recommends that uh, you book Sam. Uh, so I emailed loads of promoters and was like, "Oh, Tony Cowards recommend me." And to be fair, every single promoter got back to me and said, "If the fuck's Tony Cowards?" <laughs> That's what right, last one then. Uh, right, so Sam uh, is gender fluid. Uh, I'll be honest with you, I'm 50 years old, so I don't really understand these things. When I was Sam's age, gender fluid was what made your duvet sticky in the middle of the night. Uh, LGBTQ was a shit hand in Scrabble. And, uh, and pansexual was when you caught your uncle fucking a wok. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, I've, uh, I've done a lot of jokes tonight about uh, Tony's ex-wife. Uh, this is the stupidest joke I've ever written. So I've done a lot of jokes tonight about Tony's ex-wife. Uh, I actually uh, contacted her um, just to have a quick chat with her. We recorded it. So I'm here with Tony's ex-wife. Say hello. Hello, Tony. Okay, it's, it's, obviously it's been a while since the marriage ended. I was, I was just wondering, is there anything that you wish you were able to say to him? You've got a massive cock. <laughs> <laughs> no, what's up, what's up? It's the stupidest cock I've ever Really? Well, I wish you could say he had a massive cock. <laughs> that wasn't worth it, was it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I looked that excited. I thought that no. was going to be good. <laughs> <laughs> Turn that tip for effort, though. <laughs> That was such a premise, though, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. Man. Like, that was the best. I, I, for a minute, I was like, because I thought this was so dead, like, neck and neck. I thought, well, that might be the swinger. Mm. And, um, <laughs> yeah, that's, that's why she left. <laughs> um, could yeah. you tell who it was? What, sorry? Tony's ex could you tell who Tony's ex-wife was? No. It's Millie. Yeah, I thought that. Is yeah. It? yeah. I came up there, I was like, oh, fuck, I've only got four. So we quickly did that. Oh, shit. Should have had four. Should have done four. Yeah. <laughs> so... <laughs> okay, for, how do you uh, how do you see it going, Danny? I don't know, Fred. Genuinely, I thought like I really liked Tony's like jokes. Some of them, they didn't feel like roast. Some of them they felt like really good one-liners, but mm -hmm. really made me laugh. I think Sam had the best one punch. Do you know what I mean? Like yeah. the, the Christmas one was probably the best one out of everyone. Yeah, but I think overall I preferred Tony's. I'd, I don't I don't know. It's close, isn't it? I'm pretty much. I'm pretty much the same. Like I said, I think consistency-wise, Tony was more consistent, but Sam had that sort of 
you yeah. know, that that punch that was like, that's fucking, that's the best bit. Yeah, but I think that the end, like, uh, done me head in that. <laughs> <laughs> I sort of don't want to, like, I, I sort of can't forgive Sam for making me think that it was going to be better than it was. Yeah. yeah. And then, like, it was a, such a damp squib. That's, uh, that's pretty much what my ex-wife says to me. <laughs> yeah, but... Oh, it was it was tough on it. I, I'd rather talk to Abby again. That's how fucking. <laughs> I don't know about that. But, um, should we? I don't know what should we do. Should we? Should we do uh, audience? Yeah, but I think what we should do instead of like the whole audience, I think you should just pick one person. Oh, should we pick? Should we pick three judges? Three random yeah. judges? And then no, nope, but then. Yeah, 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 yeah. I was doing um, my math. Well, I feel like we've got to pick Victor, haven't we? Yeah, Victor I mean, look at him. He's he's. He's a hot chef, for God's sake. <laughs> he knows about roast. Um, all right. Uh, uh, Rolf, you fancy it? <laughs> all right, okay. And uh, sh should we pick one more? What about the guy that left you hanging like a dickhead? No, I, I, I've cut him out of my life. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, but this guy, I like this guy, he's got good energy. He yeah, has yeah. got good energy, hasn't he? has got good vibes in, good vibes. He's smiley, he's, mm. he's, he's kind of, he, he looks happy. What's your name? Oh, I hate that name, somehow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm joking, go on then. All right, Victor, who, uh, who, who do you think should win out of the three? Him. Him. Oh, thank you. <laughs> right. <laughs> Him. What? Them, yeah. Them. Oh, <laughs> that's how I said it. Right, not only were you vague, you misgendered someone. <laughs> <That's>... <laughs> Amazing. Yeah. Okay, so uh, Sam, uh, one nil to Sam. Uh, uh, Gordon. All right, fucking hell. <laughs> fucking hell, Diane. Um, uh, Gordon, who, how did you see this one going? I'll go with Sam. Oh, this is no. fucking bullshit. Okay. This is my mind. <laughs> Out of interest, uh, Jack, which way? I've got to go with Tony. Yeah, your vote counts for four. What? killed me. The walk. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> He's, he's too friendly, if anything, isn't he? <laughs> That's too much of a nice guy. Right, OK. Well, it was so, so super close that we just had to put it to people, but I think Sam's just taking it by your nose. Ladies and gentlemen, give a huge round of applause. Can you wait for that to